Good afternoon everybody, Russell here from LJ Hookup Lenders Park coming to you from number one of 2A Kingbourne Avenue in Seaton. Uh, what a glorious day. Not. Um, I'm going to give you a video walk through this property and this will be considered as um, a viewing. Okay, so uh, just to get started from the front here, we are, a lot of people think this is a unit, uh, but it is a fully standalone home, but it is just in a community of six so you're not exactly touching up on another person's house uh, you do have a lot of your own privacy and um, from what i know the owners do own quite a few in here as well so here we are on the main road Kingborn. we got the uh, high school down the end of the road there so as you come into the driveway which is uh you know you've got a lot of neighbors around so it's quite secure here which is great you do have your car park, so two under cover and two in the driveway. So it does feature what you'd expect from a full house. So as we come through here, normally this would be open, but for security, this has been screened up. One of the old tenants wanted their security here. They did have a, a nice car, so the owners were happy to do that. All right, so as we enter the property here, we have the master bedroom, which is a decent size. You should be able to fit a queen in here with two bedside tables, two windows there, which is great, plenty of light. And you've got your ensuite and walk-in robe. It is a pretty standard uh, build, this one, so you may recognize it, but don't mess with perfection, am I right? So uh, yeah, the ensuite here, window there as well, which is good. Walk-in robe, plenty of space in here. If it's like my house, all you get is this much. Partner gets the rest. So, back out to the hallway here. It's quite a wide hallway as well. Uh, so if you do have a wheelchair or anything, you, you will have plenty of space to get in. So this is a uh, one of the bedrooms. Window there, plenty of light. You've got the built-in robes. These owners absolutely love built-in robes. There we go. And the other side is actually hanging space as well. So through here, we have the uh, another bedroom. Now, this is probably the smallest bedroom. Uh, there is no uh, built-in robes in here, so you will need a chest of drawers. But I don't think you'll have too many, much issue getting a, a bed in here and the drawers as well. So once again, big windows, lots of light. That's what we like to see. So coming down through here, we have what we call the three-way bathroom. You have a little vanity here, mirror, and around the corner here, we've got the shower and a bath. Cannot live without one of these. So window there as well, and the second toilet. So it's a standard three-way bathroom design, can't complain. Someone can be using both of these and yet you still got the thing here, so that's great. I uh, do got the linen press here as well, bit of extra space. And the, uh, the full laundry, this laundry is uh, bigger than some bedrooms I see, so I'm actually quite impressed in here. Now, this is the main living room. Um, it is actually quite a good size in here. Uh, you do have the uh, PowerPoint over there and TV plug, so you've got the little space here for your TV. Um, then I'll get back into the corner here so you can get a bit of an idea on the size, but it's definitely quite impressive. So you've got the little meals area there. And the kitchen. Gas stove top, and I believe electric oven. Fridge space here. I believe that fridge space may be under six feet tall, so just keep that in mind. And the pantry. So definitely don't go down the same path as others and think that this is just a little unit. It's definitely a full size house. Plenty of space here to prep food, plenty of space to live. You've got a door out here to the side. If you're too lazy to go from this door to this door. 
You've got heaps of windows in here, heaps of light. I mean, what more could you want? Now, as for uh, heating and cooling, this is a heater here. Now, I had this on just before. I actually heats up this room really quickly you may need some fan heaters for the bedroom uh, but as for cooling it does have ducted evaporative now uh, i know what some people think of uh, ducted evaporative but the one thing i can tell you is you can leave it running overnight in summer and you sleep like a baby and doesn't cost you an arm and a leg either so the outside of the property here we've just got the entrance to the uh two car garage so and quite a decent yard space here as well Go around the side because we're not lazy. And here we are at the side of the property. Tool shed included. I believe those drawers at the back will stay as well. Alrighty. I'm really glad I got to show you this property today. As I said a lot of people seem to think I'm renting a unit here. But as you can see, it is a full house. So thank you very much for watching this video. Uh, by watching this video, it is considered a viewing. So you can apply simply by asking for the uh, to apply link, hit the orange button, apply online and go for there. Thank you very much for watching.